Hey guys, it's Fantasy Simmer, and you guys are probably like, what is this? Because you guys see 100 Baby Challenge, but there's just the thumbnail to the 100 Baby Challenge on the screen, and I'm talking. <laughs> well, um, let me explain this. So, um, I knew that Ashley, the person who has the babies in this let's play, I knew that she was getting close to an elder, and I knew she could only have a few more babies, and basically what I did was I played off camera like all day today, like the whole day, literally, I played and played and played, I was speeding it through, and I recorded the important moments. So when she had a baby, or no, when she got pregnant, when she had a baby, um, when the babies aged up, when the kids aged up, teens aged up, when the teens you know, aged up to adults and then moved out, I recorded all that and kind of put it together into one video, and there's gonna be music playing, and I hope you guys aren't mad at me. The reason I did this was because I am at part, what is it, 52 now? I think this is part 52. And we only had 14 babies. And the reason for that was because I wasn't playing off camera enough. Um, almost for the whole challenge, I didn't, I didn't play off camera at all until like recently. I started playing off camera like a little bit, but still barely. And I was recording everything, even when she couldn't get pregnant because there was too many Sims in the household. I was still just recording all of it. So... Other people that are doing the 100 Baby Challenge are probably way ahead of me when they're at part 52, but that is because I wasn't playing off camera, like, mostly through the whole thing. So that's why I decided to do this, so we could, you know, speed through it a little bit. At the end of this, we actually only end up with 16 babies, and you guys, I don't want to spoil anything, you guys will see what happens in these clips, and yeah, at the end, it'll show something else that I don't really want to talk about, but at the end of this um, little thing I put together, I will have another voiceover at the end and I'll explain some more things to you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little video I put together and I will see you guys at the end of this because I'm going to be talking again. <laughs>
Okay guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed all those little clips and I hope you guys aren't confused at all. Basically, it was just all the birthdays, the babies born, um, them moving out, just, you know, and I didn't cheat at all, 100% no cheating, I am totally against that for challenges. Um, I waited until every single kid had an A in school and then I aged them up to a teen and then until every single teen had an A in school and then aged them up to a adult. Unless I didn't get them to an A in time and it was their birthday anyways. And then as you guys saw, Ashley died. So while I was playing, you guys saw she turned into an elder and she couldn't have any more babies. So that was a big reason why it was good that I did that off camera because almost the whole time I was just playing and playing and playing and just aging the kids up. No more babies were happening. You can't have any more babies once you're an elder. So yeah, that would have been pretty boring and like, I don't know. So that was that. And then I, w I knew it was getting to her last days and I was like, no. And I kept getting the notification saying that, you know, like her time is coming to an end or whatever it says. And then she died and I was like, <gasps> so yeah, Ashley is now gone and it's so sad. And we have her little um, tombstone thing or whatever the thing that her ashes are kept in. We have that in the living room. You guys will see when I come back with another part. And at the end, you guys see that the new baby maker is Daisy. And, um, at first I thought it was going to be, oh, what's the other girl's name? The girl that has the purple hair in this video. But then she ended up getting an A first in school. So then she aged up and the rules are that the youngest daughter takes over. So Daisy ended up being the youngest daughter because she was aged up last. And I was actually happy about that because I think out of all the kids that were left, well, there's only two teens left. Anyways, I thought she was really pretty and she looks a lot like Ashley. So yeah, that's kind of cool. So I don't know if the kids are going to end up looking similar to Ashley's children, but yeah. Um, in the next part, um, there's going to be obviously a new baby maker. There's going to be no kids in the house because everyone's moved out and we're at 16 babies now and I'm hoping to get to 20 babies as soon as possible. Um, I'm going to be playing off camera just for things that aren't important, but there will be another part very soon and I actually have Daisy already romantic with a guy and she was about to woohoo with him or try for a baby try for a baby with him so that's when I stopped playing off camera and I'm going to start recording right from there and hopefully she'll get pregnant from that guy if not we'll try again and yeah um the house is all redone another thing I was able to do while I played off camera is save up a ton of money because Ashley couldn't get pregnant when she was an elder so she had so much time she literally painted all the time like almost all day like every day <laughs> so yeah and then some of the teenagers were painting as well so we ended up saving up like over 35,000 simoleons I believe I don't remember exactly but I know it was over 35,000 and yeah I just went crazy we have a backyard now with a pool and uh, we have a little deck area we have a barbecue we have a big kitchen all set up nicely we have a nice table we have a nicer living room and then as for the upstairs the upstairs is pretty similar i made the house a little bit bigger um we're in the same house but it's a little bit bigger and then the kids bedroom is completely empty because there's no kids right now but as um daisy starts having children i will slowly start furnishing that room so I hope you guys are looking forward to this and please don't be upset because Ashley's time was coming to an end anyways. Um, literally, we would have had two more babies on camera, which I recorded anyways for you guys, but it's just in shorter clips. But if I was to do actual parts on having those two more babies, it would have just been two more. It wouldn't have been anything crazy happening. It would have just been, you know, me speeding through, aging up kids, moving them out yeah basically everything you saw here but instead it's in a shorter form and you guys you know so yeah <laughs> um yeah there's nothing really else to say I'm like running out of things to say and I hope you guys are excited like I said and yeah we're on the second baby maker and hopefully this will be more successful um some people think that 16 babies is good for the first like generation of the 100 baby challenge other people think that you know something's wrong if you're only having 16 babies at like part 52 or 51 because it was 51 but you know everyone you know thinks differently about it and I made it to 16 babies with first generation let's see how much babies we can have for the second generation so yeah I guess we'll find out and I want to do better this time I want to have more babies with Daisy I'm going to not record every single little bit I will obviously record full parts but if she's not pregnant or nobody's aging up and you know I'm just like doing nothing then I'm not gonna record that so yeah 
I'm gonna stop rambling. This voiceover is like five minutes. So I hope you guys stuck to the end of this video. If you did, you're awesome. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.